Hello, I'm Pastor Spencer from Messiah Lutheran Church in Salem, Oregon. And tonight, Wednesday, May 5th, our evening devotion is based on the 44th Psalm, the second part. We begin in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. But you have rejected us and disgraced us, and have not gone out with our armies. You have made us turn back from the foe, and those who hate us have gotten spoil. You have made us like sheep for slaughter, and have scattered us among the nations. You have sold your people for a trifle, demanding no high price for them. You have made us the taunt of our neighbors and the derision and scorn of those around us. You have made us a byword among the nations, a laughingstock among the people. All day long my disgrace is before me, and shame has covered my face. As the sound of the taunter and the reviler, at the sight of the enemy and the avenger, all this has come upon me, though we have not forgotten you. And we have not been false to your covenant. Our heart has not turned back, nor have our steps departed from your way. Yet you have broken us in the place of jackals, and have covered us with the shadow of death. If we had forgotten the name of our God, or spread out our hands to a foreign God, would not God discover this? For he knows the secret of the heart. Yet... For your sake, we are killed all the day long and are regarded as sheep to be slaughtered. Awake, why are you sleeping, O Lord? Rouse yourself, do not reject us forever. Why do you hide your face? Why do you forget our affliction and oppression? For our soul is bowed down to the dust, our belly clings to the ground. Rise up, come to our help, redeem us for the sake of your steadfast love. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. And our evening prayer is, Lord, our gracious Father, at all times grant us Christian resignation to the order and guidance of your protective care. Preserve us from discontentment under the cross and from envy against those who enjoy prosperity. Lead us as you will, but when our end comes, take us home to yourself. This we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. And now may the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine upon you, be gracious unto you. May the Lord lift his countenance upon you and give you peace. Amen. And may the Lord grant you a quiet evening and a joyful rest and a refreshing waking morning. This we pray in Jesus' name.